everything. Everything we may have burn out. Nothing, nothing, nothing leave. This morning about 2.30. I eat in you know, my house and feel a feel a fire eat. And when, when I, I pull it door and come out, I see the whole building upstairs and everything in a, in a free room, fear fire. I could I, I could have made a come to come to the door. I'm going to come to the door and come with that shit. I couldn't go back in. I'm going to call my daughter until it's a fire in the place and make them come out. I'm going to tell them back place and make them come out. Everything, everything we may have, burn out. Nothing, nothing, nothing will leave. My last, my clothes, my last, my money, my last, my TV, my last, my fridge. My last, my bicycle, my last, everything, everything we may have, burn out. Everything. I have nothing really. left. I'm going to be like me right now. How long have you been living here? I'm 19... I'm 1975. I'm 1975. So, you know, you know, you know, you know, you've shared a lot of... You've lived a lot of memories and, and stuff. Hold up a memory, man. Hold up a memory, man. Hold up a thing. 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 Hold I guess I'm going to go to years ago. I'm going to go down, I'm going to go down, I'm going to go down, I'm going to go down. Any idea of where is this coming from? I don't know where it's coming from, you know. And I don't know why, but then it's come back, it's back up to my house. I don't know why, where I'm doing it. I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know what I'm going to do right now. Because I don't know how I'm going to make the move. Right now, I'm going to help you. They help me to do something, but they can't do back something. Because I'm not going to go. They can't do back something, you know, before them, them still, they're not going to fix up, but we can't wait for them. They have to look so to live. This is a location that we had under the radar to, re, to rebuild under the social housing program, the Ministry of Economic Growth Social Housing Program. In fact, I had recommended this location as one of the beneficiaries under that program because it was a wooden, mainly a wooden structure, obviously a wooden structure, really dilapidated. So early this morning I got the call that it was on, on fire. Um, the police is here. Um, I gather they are doing some investigations to determine whether there is any arson involved. I'm here to try to find out what is what on the ground. So I'll be talking to the re residents mm -hmm. to get their their um to find out exactly what their views are. For several months, you know, Kingston Central were, was relatively quiet. Yes, it seems to be we're a, doing well. A, a flare up now. A, 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 a yeah, I don't know what is happening. I don't know. There is some, especially in the spoilers era. You know, Smith Lane, Wildman Street, Price Lane. Text lane, this very lane that we're on, there seems to be some tension. Um, and I, I will tell you that the police have saturated the space because I've, I've driven through and, you know, I'm never here and don't see a patrol. So I know the police have it on their, their under surveillance and close watch. I can tell you that we need to monitor the space and get to the bottom and the root of what is happening here. Because Central Kingston is pretty quiet now, you know, all over, you know, we're, we're pretty quiet. So we don't know what is really happening in spoilers. Rose Garden, this part. And it's not necessarily a large area, you know. Mm -hmm. If you notice the roads, the, the streets are very close mm -hmm. and they run parallel to each other. It's a very small space and we need to bring it under control.